Oh yes, this is it. This is the third day I've been out here looking for remnants of the contour channel. I'm just climbing up to the hill behind us to have a look up there and then see what's there. I still find it extraordinary the amount of work they've done here to put this channel into place. This part of the channel is actually quite wide. The walls aren't as steep and there's no slope on them. So it's a bit easier to get into. Once again, ahead we've got the uh, water pipe that carries the runoff from the top of the hill over the contour channel and then down the hill on the other side. And it continues on through the bushes. Slopes here start to, well the sides start to slope outwards. And look at the size of that grass tree. He's pretty old that one. This contour channel was apparently a bit a feat of engineering uh, back in the day, especially when all of this work was pretty much done manually, including hauling those big pipes up. The other thing I've found out today is that apparently there's two other contour channels. Um, one uh, comes from a gully a bit further down Brookton Highway and feeds water from there into the Canning Dam. But there's also apparently another one that goes all the way from Canning Dam to Mundaring Weir. Now I can't find any other record than one, one comment in an um, online uh, document. Whether it's true or not, I don't know, and I can't find any evidence of that on Google Earth. It may be true, it may not be, who knows. I've walked up this thing, shit. Crazy. Well, like I said yesterday, it's hard to leave and not find something. And I've come out again looking for the uh, chimney, one closest to the dam, and it's been pretty hard going and I'm pushing through some pretty dense bush. I'm not sure whether I have found it or found the rocky outcrop, but have a look at the stuff I've got to go through to get there. Over in there, there's a mound of rock. I don't know whether that is the chimney or whether it is just a mound of rock, but look at the shit I've got to go through to get to it. It is dense and there's fallen scrub everywhere. Oh yes, this is it. That's the chimney. My goodness, look at the rubbish that's around here. So once upon a time you could walk in here a lot easier than what you can now. There's even a bin here which hasn't been emptied for some time I would suggest. And this is the stone chimney. I've actually found it. Sweet as. And this is the other side of the chimney. 
looks like light rail as a lintel. Wow, got here. And look how dense this bush is. And I've got to go through that way somewhere. <laughs> Alright, off to see the second one. The first thing I spotted was this rubbish bin from the cut park. And yep, a lot of shit in there too. And then the chimney's in the bush. It actually says it's visible from the road, but I've driven past here four or five times looking in this area and I have not spotted this. Anyway, that's probably a good thing because it means the clowns can't come in here and wreck it. The description to this particular site was a lot harder to find um, and the only way I could find the clearing uh, was through Google Earth. But once I got here, there's the chimney right behind me. Uh, quite impressive.